Hello and welcome to this guide on how to change your capital world in Stellaris by hacking the save files. Now in the game you can't actually change your capital world which is uh, quite annoying because the starter world is uh, not exactly the best. It's decent but you can find better. The capital world buff is uh, pretty good so naturally you want this on your best planet. And I found this 25 slot Gaia world which is uh, really really good so how do we change this around now first you need to make sure that the new capital world is not in a sector it needs to be in the core sector which is basically just uh, this sector that is not in one of these sectors uh, that's just called the core sector now we also need to know the name of the planets so let's write this down so we can remember it. Terra and Valhalla. Yes, I have very short memory. And we also need to know what our empire is called so we can find the save file. And uh, I think that is all we, no we need to know. So let's hit save. And let's do homeworld uh, edits. I strongly suggest you make a backup of these saves before you actually attempt this, just in case something goes wrong. And remember to not save to the cloud, we need to save this locally. Hit save, and uh, let's exit. Now we need to find the save file, which is located in Documents, Paradox Interactive, Stellaris, Saved Games, and here we can find Human Stellar Union, which is our empire. In here we can find our save files, but before we can actually do anything with them, we need to change the last file type to .zip. And now we can extract the actual game files. The meta file we won't actually do anything to, but the game state file we can open in notepad plus plus or anything else now the first thing we need to do is to find what the save file is assigning our planet to so instead of just writing terra or whatever the planet's name is every time it needs to refer to that planet it just enters a number so we can find this number by writing name is equal to Terra. And here we can find all the information about Terra in this save file. The 3 here denotes that this is the number that is assigned to Terra um, that we need to remember. So let's write this Terra equals 3. Now, in addition to this, we need to find our modifier right here, time modifier, the capital modifier. The days minus one just means that, well, it's never ending. So we can cu cut that out and we can then paste it into the uh, save file portion for our new world. So let's find it by typing in Valhalla. Here you can see 2394 is the assignment for Valhalla. Let's also write this down. 2394. Boom. Now we can go ahead and enter our modifier. You can do this anywhere in the file. Time modifier, modifier capital and all that. Alright. So now the planet Valhalla 2394 has this modifier, but we need to also make it the capital. So we can do this by entering capital equals 3. Here we can find it. So capital equals 3. If you go further up the save file, you will actually find that all of this is just a section for our empire. 
So we can find information like ethnic individualist and all this. But we don't want the old capital. So let's just change this to 2394, like that. Now we need to do the same thing in our core sector. So just find next again. And here you can find that the first in the sectors here is always the core sector. You can find more sectors over here, but we only need to focus on the core one. So let's replace this by 2394. We can also edit the name. It doesn't really matter though, but let's just edit this to Valhalla. And that is actually everything we need to do. So let's hit save and exit out of the program. Now we need to make a new archive of this. I use 7-zip. I'm pretty sure you can use whatever you want. Add to archive. We want the format to be zip. It's also pretty important that you use the TC equals off. Otherwise, it might not be able to read the save file. So, okay. There we go. And now we just rename this to dot save. Yes. And uh, let's launch our game. See what happens. Now, hopefully, if this works, it should have changed the capital world to Valhalla, and it should also have given it the capital world buff. This is in 1.0.3, so I'm not sure if it will work in later patches, but uh, I can't really see why it shouldn't. Hopefully they will actually implement the ability to change your capital in the future. So let's hit load game and uh, load our save. And there we go. Valhalla is the new capital world. And that is how you do it. Pretty easy actually. If you see the Terra, you can also see that this is no longer our capital world. But Valhalla is. So that's how you do it. If you found this helpful, please like and uh, share around to your friends. And uh, thank you for watching.